Dad, you won't believe what just happened. Our neighbor's website crashed because too many people tried to access it at once. Oh no. That's like when everyone tries to use our bathroom during my famous chili night. Actually, that's a perfect analogy. You see, there's this thing called a reverse proxy that could have prevented this. Reverse what now? Sounds like some fancy dance move. No, you imbecile. Think of it like a traffic cop for websites. It stands between visitors and the web server, directing traffic to prevent overcrowding. Oh, like when I direct people to different bathrooms during chili night. Yes, surprisingly accurate. The reverse proxy can also cache content, like keeping a spare roll of toilet paper nearby. And what else does this magical traffic cop do? It adds security by hiding the real server location, balances loads across multiple servers, and can even compress data to make websites faster. Wow, that's actually pretty cool. Like having a bouncer at a club who also makes drinks and keeps troublemakers away. Indeed, and companies like Netflix and Amazon use reverse proxies to handle millions of users without breaking a sweat. Hey, maybe we should get one for our bathroom situation. That's, that's not how it works, Dad. Let's just stick to websites, shall we?